Welcome everyone to Action Figure Imagery What's in Store Volume 1. This is a new feature series right here on this channel of Action Figure Imagery. This is the first volume and this uh, first segment will focus on a local target and it's, it'll be where I'll go to a local target or a local Walmart or any other store and I'll take pictures of the figures that are available at a time you see here the G.I. Joe classified aisle you see the Tiger Force Dusty and and um, you see a Cobra Commander figure, a small reaction figure right there, along with Copperhead and Rock and Roll and a Cobra Python. Um, and also you see those um, Power Ranger figures on the right hand side in a little corner. There's a closer look at them. Uh, I didn't get a good photograph of them. I, I think those are the um, Karate Kid characters posed as Power Rangers figures right there at the top. A regular, there's a more clear picture. There's Scrap Iron from Target. You see he was forty forty four ninety nine. I wasn't able to, I was, I had planned on going back to get him. I, my money was tight at the time. I passed on him. I, I regret doing it. I hope I can get him next time. There's some DC Multiverse figures you see there, Joker, and can't tell who that is next to him. And you see the Blue Beal on the right-hand side. Some more, some Superman Multiverse figures. McFarlane, Flash figure right there up front. And some more figures on the side. Some blurry photographs of some Transformers, but many of you... I'm sure many of you already know who that is anyway, even, I'm sorry about the blurry photograph, but you all know that's definitely Bumblebee, at least I think that's Bumblebee, Bumblebee right there, and another blurry shot, I thought I had deleted some of these pictures, but it's, um, the page puncher figures, the new 3-inch DC figures at the top, superhero figures, there's a clearer photograph right there, you see some Buzz Lightyear figures, along with some Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, some Disney Pixar at the top, some Jurassic Park walkie-talkies, uh, more Jurassic Park figures right here at the top, see a Triceratops, and, um, the Toho series, uh, I think that's Godzilla if I'm not mistaken, I think that was a Godzilla figure, um, some Indiana Jones figures right there, little, the little figures, the smaller figures that is, the three reaction figures uh, made by Super 7. I think that's what those are. And then the uh, uh, Mattel WWE figures right here. You see D'Lo Brown and Roman Reigns and Kama Mustafa in this picture. And you see the Undertaker if you look up right. And here are some Masters of the Universe, Masterverse figures. Clawful, Whiplash. I was able to get Clawful and Whiplash. You can see in the last video, I wasn't able to get Ram Man. I hope I can. Uh, I I was hoping to get him, and go back to purchase him, but he wasn't there when I went back. To, so I ho hopefully had add Ram Man to my collection someday. And below you see the Point Dread and the Talon Fighter for the Origin series, and you see a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles playset below, and all kind of cars right here, Micro Machines, Hot Wheels, um, and you see the Tech Deck uh, merchandise on the right hand side some more Hot Wheel products right there in Tech Deck. And I can't tell what that yellow car is next to the Hot Wheels. I don't know if that's Bumblebee or Transformer or what. I I apologize for all these blurry photographs, folks. Uh, here's a clear one right here. You see the Fast and the Furious uh, diorama. That's pretty cool. It's small. And then Hunter. Rick Hunter's 1977 Plymouth Fury, that blue car. So you see Optimus Prime at the bottom shelf. There's another look at that uh, Fast and the Furious uh, diorama I was referring to earlier. And you see Mario Kart, Mario inside the uh, go-kart next to that. And there's the Hot Wheels section right there. Um, that Hot Wheels section with that blue dinosaur looks pretty fun for kids. I'm sure they'll have a blast with that. If you got some real young kids, uh, three to five years old, they'll, I'm sure they'll enjoy that. Uh, some other pictures of it right there. That, I like the one with the shark. It looks pretty cool and bring back good memories when, from childhood. And 
the green snake, but that's a nice one also. I like that. There's a turtle right there. I can't tell which turtle it is. Looks like uh, Michelangelo. It looks like it. Either it's either Michelangelo or uh, Raphael. Uh, Raphael is the one in the red. Michelangelo wears orange. So it's one of those two. It's not Donatello or Leonardo. Donatello is the one in the purple. Leonardo is the one in the blue. Um, can't tell what cars these are because they're blurry. But they look pretty nice. There's another Hot Wheels section again. The small Hot Wheel toys right there. You can get plenty of Hot Wheels. You got the individual uh, sets and you got the uh, five packs and you got the uh, World of Nintendo Mario, Super Mario figures over here in this section. You, know, you see Mario, and Luigi, uh, Toad, Princess Toad's Stew, and a three pack right there. Even a castle. I didn't know, I didn't even see the, I don't even remember the castle when I was there in person. I overlooked it. I did not know I took a photograph of the castle. Well, now, until I saw this picture, and there's a, another set right there. It looks pretty cool. Um, I passed on this because my money was tight at the time. I wish I would have purchased it now. Um, see all the, the villains at the bottom, the heroes at the top. There's Caterpillar. I forget which Super Mario game that Caterpillar comes from, but he's in one of them. There's Mario and Luigi. There's Mario standing on top of them. And Pikachu Pokemon merchandise here. Next time I do this, folks, I'm going to plan on having better pictures, I promise. Uh, much more higher quality than what you see here. That's it, folks, for this video. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Everyone have a blessed day, and we'll see you in the next video.